Hey guys, welcome back. So today we finally have our first Dune trailer, our first official Dune trailer. I'm so excited and I know you are too. So let's jump right in. Let's jump right in and take a look. Oh my God. <sighs> Oh, and I'm loving it so far. It hasn't even started. Oh my god. And look, here's why. Here's why. Even the logo is freaking amazing. <laughs> because it's like dissolving or blowing away like sand. Which is consistent with the story. It's so cool. <laughs> Just the thought that, that they put this much thought into the trailer suggests that they put even more thought into the film itself and so i'm even more excited it's gonna be so good there's something happening to me there's something awake oh and this is this is the other thing about this i mentioned before in the teaser trailer reaction the cinematography of this film but i love this is gonna be one of those films where every scene is gonna be like its own work of art and I love those kinds of movies. I love when they do that, when they put that much effort into stylizing each scene. So good. Oh, it just, it, it just takes your breath away. In my mind, I can't control it. What did you see? <gasps> that, I love that scene. I love these two. I love that they're cast in this film. <laughs> There's a crusade coming. This is done incredibly well too and we we kind of know what this scene probably is we we kind of know what this is from either if you've watched the last movie or the original movie or you've read the books you know what this is this scene is done well too um i love the contrasting color i can't say i can't say enough about how well shot and how well lit this is but this is a great scene and a great representation of what's happening i love it Do you often dream things that happen just as you dream them? Yeah. Oh, this is the scene. This is the scene from the teaser trailer that was ahead of the Tenet movie. Oh my god, if they show the rest of it. This is so freaking powerful. This is such a powerful scene. And it's so well done. It's actually done better. It's done better than in the original film. And I love the original film. So for me to say that, like, you have i'm just i am beside myself <laughs> i am beside i am outdone i am outdone by all of this already and we're just 30 seconds into it. Yes. paladin beautiful beautiful the blue of the water against the sunset or sunrise just the test is simple Remove your hand from the box, and you die. Yes! 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 Die. What's in the box? Pain. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! This is such a good scene! Oh! Oh my god! This is it! Oh my god! And this is- Okay, so let me- Let me- Let me breathe breathe <laughs> okay so you one of the things about this scene okay to contrast it with the original film the way they represented it was sort of a bit bizarre because they showed you i mean you saw the expression on his face so you you knew that he felt pain and you hear the the recantation or the re re words fine words you <laughs> You hear him reciting the litany that we saw in the teaser trailer in his mind in the scene in the original film. However, the, the other thing that they did was they showed you this weird representation of what he felt or what he saw, what he was experiencing. And it was just really, I felt it, it took, it showed you too much. I felt like you needed to feel and experience and understand what he was going through from the actor, from the actor expressing it on his face and through his emotion and you didn't see it as strongly in the original film as you do here <laughs> this is this is what i wanted in the original film and i hope they don't do that visual representation thing um because you don't see it 
I'm so I'm hoping they don't do the same thing. I hope they they put it all on Timothy and let him show us through his acting what he's going through. And I think that's what they're doing here. And I'm buying it. I'm buying it. This is this is pain. This is what pain looks like. This is what pain looks like. And I I'm in. I'm I I'm sold. I am bought on the idea that he is feeling pain with his hand in this box. And I love it. I love they chose to do it this way. And I just, I, oh, I, oh my God. This scene is so freaking amazing. This kid, get him an Oscar. Get him, get him his awards now. Just give them to him. You inherit too much power. Okay, so this is, I'm guessing, the scene where he's leaving. This is his last day on his home planet. So that's, you, you can, you can feel you know, the anxiety, you can feel the excitement. Um, you don't know what's ahead of you. You're a kid. Your your family's moving under some, you know, precarious circumstances. And you you just you don't know what to expect, right? And you get that here. You he is exuding that in this scene and I absolutely love it. I love You it. inherit too much power. You have proven you can rule yourself. Hey, shield. Shield. Okay. And the Listen, let me back up. It is so incredibly difficult to represent this particular shield and fighting style technique, whatever you want to call it, on screen. And you've seen similar representations of this before where the, the individual sort of, they're moving so quickly, it, it, it's almost like they vibrate across the screen. But here, what I love is the introduction of the introduction of color. It adds an, an extra layer of depth, I think, to what it is that you're seeing. To not just see bodies vibrating across the screen, but to also see the color uh, that represents what would be emanating from them as they're doing this. And there would be some emanation of of energy, right? And so to show that this way, I think is is brilliant. It's absolutely brilliant. They thought of it. They thought of everything. Now you must learn to rule others. Something none of your ancestors learned. Oh, be better than your ancestors. You have to, you have to be better. And Leto looks so freaking good. Look at Oscar Isaac on here. Oh, you know this man has been through it. You know he has been through it. Oh, and what he's embarking on too with his son, because this is this is still Kaladan here, right? I would think so. Um, so this is sort of everybody's. Um, I'm guessing this is everybody's last day, and they're dealing with whatever they have to deal with and reckon with prior to leaving. My father rules an entire planet. He's losing it. Oh, so you again, you're getting. You're getting a better sense of the circumstances of what they're going through, of what the family is experiencing. So we saw earlier, and, and even now, we know this is a powerful family. We know they have a lot of influence. We know they have a great deal of wealth. Well, where is that going? You know, what is happening now? Um, well, we're about to see, right? Uh, it's being foretold here. Arrakis. We're on Arrakis now. Yay! Yay! He's getting a richer one. Oh, those! Oh my God, the uniforms are so freaking awesome. You lose that one too. Stuck in Idaho. <laughs> Just chasing my mom. Arrakis is a death trap. Oh, wow! This. Oh my God. This is gonna be so good. He looks so good here. Oh my god. Kill him. There we go. There we go. This is it. This is Can I say something about the music here? The music here is oh my the freaking music is so amazing. Oh you just you feel it in your bones, like you feel it in your soul. I love it. Extermination. They're picking my family off one by one. You gotta do something about it. You gotta do something about it, Paul. Let's fight like demons. Oh, this scene. Oh my god. Oh, yes. Oh, let me back up. Let's, let's, let's look at this again. First of all, 
Oh, he looks okay. And Jason looks, he looks good in the same way. He looks different. Like he doesn't really necessarily look like himself. So he transformed too for this. I, mm, I'm so just in shock right now. <laughs> just like demons. An animal caught in a trap will gnaw off its own leg to escape. What will you do? What will you do, Paul? What will you do? You have no idea what he's capable of. I know you. Oh, the scene. She looks... And again, Zendaya embodies this character. She is Chani. She will forever be Chani. This is it. This is it for me. Oh! Oh my god. One day. Yes! Duncan! <laughs> Legend will be born. Oh, I love this. Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. What is. No. No. <gasps> no. Is this the. All of civilization depends on it. The future. I can see it. Oh my god. Oh, the Furman looks good. Really good. Beyond fear. And you can you can sense the confidence growing in Paul throughout <laughs> Oh. Charlie looks so good. I love this casting. This is amazing. Like this scene is doomed. This scene, this shot, this still shot is doomed. In a nutshell. I must not fear. Oh, he is such a great actor. I gotta say too, the costumes are amazing. I mean, the still suits look good. The material looks and feels authentic. It just, it feels very rugged and raw and set in this world. Like, it's from this universe, you can tell. Um, I love, th I love everything about that. I really do. Fear. Yes. Here's the mind killer. My Lord Duke. Where the fear is gone. Oh, Jesus, how powerful is that? How powerful is that? Only I will remain. Oh my god! Only I will remain. Oh, this is... Oh. oh my god. Oh my god. No. The same Oh go! so good now i will say i'm i'm expecting more i'm expecting more from the sandworm i i get this look i get where they're going for with this i do and i love it i like it but there is something missing there is something missing visually here that i'm again i'm not gonna spoil it but there's something else that should be in this scene there's something else that should be here um here <laughs> in this area they're about and i think where they cut it off is what we're going to see i think where they cut it off in the film is where we will see the part that's missing that's going to be so freaking amazing and actually makes this make sense i am just I I can't even speak. I don't even know what to say. I am so pleased with this trailer. <laughs> like I am thrilled. I am I feel I've gotten a lot. I I I'm going to have to watch it again and probably multiple times to get everything 
that I know I've missed, <laughs> but I am just so, this is great. This is an incredibly well done trailer. I'm excited for this film. I want to see more. I want another trailer. <laughs> so hopefully they'll release another one. I know they will. Another one between now and then. I am just, I feel it did what it needed to do. It introduced us to the characters. It introduced us to the world. It showed us a little bit of Paul's journey. And we see um, his evolution a little bit, even in this trailer. So I can imagine what it's going to be on screen. I love the shots. I love the cinematography. I love the coloring. I love the sound design, the music, the scores. This is going to have the best, this is going to have the best soundtrack probably of any film this year. I just, the casting is great. Oh, how, the, the decisions they made, the decisions they made in changes between this film and the last one so far are freaking epic. I love them. So those are my thoughts. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time.